Hi guys, it's Christine here from Red Hot Dance Fitness and you're on day four of the 30 ways in 30 days to a healthier you challenge. Day four, we're going to take a little different uh, approach. We've talked so far about water and about breakfast and about adding grains into your diet and I'm hoping that you've taken those three tasks and have um, added those things into your, to your daily routine. Now today we're going to add something that's more for your uh, well-being and um, for your uh, mental health. So today we're going to talk about morning pages. You can do this activity at night as well, um, but what I want you to do is grab yourself a journal or a notebook, some paper, and you want to place this notebook right next to your bed. Today's tip is about releasing your mind and being um, uh, in a more positive spirit throughout your day. So what we're going to do each morning is you're going to need to set your alarm 10 minutes early. So maybe go to bed a few minutes early as well. And when you get up in the morning, I want you to focus on writing 10 things you're, you're grateful for. So this is a gratitude journal in some senses. You're going to write um, maybe the things that you're grateful for, your family, your friends, your home, your job. There's a lot of things that you're going to want to be thinking about. They could be very little things. But just think about the things that you are grateful for. You know, I heard Oprah say that every morning she starts her day with thank you. Just thank you for allowing me to wake up in the morning. And that's such a simple thing, but it's so, so very powerful. So I want you to think about that and think about the things that you're grateful for each day. Then, as an option, I want you to take uh, either a second journal, if you want to keep these two journals separate, or maybe in the back half, start one in the front, one in the back, just a stream of consciousness for a few minutes, and just write, kind of think of it as your outlet for venting, for any negativity, for just think of it as verbal diarrhea that you're just going to just get out there to just let go. Many times we hold on to a lot of negativity, and that's how we start our day, and we want to actually start our day with releasing the negative, being grateful for all the positive and then approaching our day. So again, you could do some of this in the evening if you prefer. You could do both in the morning and the evening. It's really up to you, but I want you to take this task seriously and just give yourself at least 10 minutes every day to, again, release the negative and be grateful for all the things in your life. So that's day four, and we'll see you tomorrow.